Hello YouTube and welcome to my Wilderness AVNGs guide and I'm going to show you how to get two AVNGs and kill them I guess. Um, let me talk about the inventory setup as we go from here. The reason I start off at Edgeville is because I'm thinking of a, f of a sure way that everyone could get there for the first time and then they adjust their routes as they go along. You could of course take Mage Bank from there on or um, you could take the, the Wilderness Teleport things to take you to the god near the God Wars dungeon, but for the first time we're all gonna start off at the same place. Let me see this. Black Knights Fortress, alright. So what you wanna do is head here. Let me get these energy pots. And I'll talk about the setup as we go there since it's the long trip. Right up here on the top left edge, and then just head straight north. Don't deviate from your path. Um what I want to talk about. Alright, for Purers, this would be your best setup. I would not recommend bringing a Mitre. I did some, nearly a mill for it. Just bring any hat you want. Mitre costs a mill, it's too risky to bring just on heavy angies. For the bolts, I'd recommend broad bolts. I don't have 55 slayer yet, so I'm gonna work on that eventually. Um, and again, if you're a tank or a main, by all means, adjust to whatever you have. Like, if you have Zamrock Chives, bring that, but you make sure you have a Ceridomini item and a Zamrock item. This is like 150k, I don't mind that. I don't mind losing that. So, where are we? We're... Okay. General store, okay. I know where I'm at. Whew. Okay. I believe this is it, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, this is how you enter the God Wars dungeon, if I'm, again if I'm not mistaken. Yep, move boulder, 60 strength is required as the God Wars dungeon. These the banshees drop noted bars. Oops. Spiritual mage, ooh, that is a problem. Okay, there we go. Here we are, the banshees. I just want to get Amardal off my ass. I'm wondering if he is off my ass. These guys are, ooh, bandos after me now. Huh? But again, this is my first trip here. You adjust as you go along. Let me see. There we are. You just need to kill them. I don't know. They just, they just drop noted bars. Again, if you could bring more, more items as armor dial. And bandos with you, then, then why not? But make sure you don't risk it. I don't know how much, like how much it would be worth it to get no adamant bars. Let me see how much they go for right now. Adamant height bar. They currently go for two thousand six hundred each. I'm gonna throw bolts. I didn't get any adamant bars then. But they drop noted bars. That's the, that's the trade off of their risk. I mean, if like I found, by the way, if I'm like tanking it, then you should be able to tank it too, you know. You just need to have enough prayer bonus as well. Um, this concludes. Oh, yeah, spiritual mage. I'm gonna just, you could just move around and avoid the spiritual mage, or if you want to bring armor dial item, like at the pendant or anything like that, then why not? This concludes the, the guide, I suppose. And uh, like, comment, subscribe. And have a good day. Ooh, almost died there. Let me move away from the spiritual mage first. And then I'll tell you guys goodbye. Baby, come back. Again, uh, this this main purpose of the guide is just to show you how to get there. By all means, you adjust your you adjust whatever you need to adjust to do what you gotta do. You could be keep PK'd here, so you gotta take that into account and be ready to defend yourself at all times. Thank you. Have a good day.